Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to say thank you so very much. Thank you guys for the support so far. So the, the whole evangelism movement, the political evangelism movement, the new Nigeria evangelism movement, is not, it's not like a movement movement per se. It's just out of some, a youth that is tired of this country, tired of the system, the political system, and these men that are not ready to give us the change we seek, the change we deserve making it look like when they give us road, give us light, we should be happy. Nigeria, Nigeria don't spoil to the point that we say, if we see light, we be happy, we they thank God. If we see good roads, we'll be happy. If we see water, we'll be happy. So I started this whole stuff. I initially, I used to rent. The, the mic and speaker, you see me, I rent them, you know, every day. So I posted on Twitter and some person came up, one man. His name is 100 over 100. That's his name, you know. And it's like, how much is this speaker? You use. I don't know how I got to know that I, I rent them. Or I rent it rather. I said how much is it? I told him the price and he's like, You're going to receive an alert. I was just there and man, luckily the the money came in and I got this for myself. So thank you very much. Hundred over hundred. I really appreciate this so much. So right now, the movement is now going to be beyond just where I have been doing it. I'll be coming to your state, I'll be coming to your city. The, this one, evangelism, you understand? Marketplaces, we are going everywhere, rural areas. We we'll try to sensitize them, let them know the reason why they should get their PVC. All right, let them know that buying of votes is real. Like when they buy your vote, they are buying it because your votes, they count. Now the major focus be that. And also I like to say this one to some persons who feel i'm doing it because it's a pit it's not a pit i'll be say uh, maybe because everybody they support it i'll be no i'm supporting somebody that has vision now so the matter job be if zulu zulu was to be contesting for president and peter was not contesting now I'll, I'll, I'll support zulu it's not about say let the youth i've been seeing people say it's time for the youth i don't think it's anything time it's not time for this it's time for somebody that has vision so if you don't have vision for this country, you, I don't think you're fit for the seat. It's not an age thing. If we have any aged person that is not too old, that has the vision, we'll vote that person in. Not be youth. We've had youth with us like us. I don't want to call names. We had a youth that was agitating for this whole change thing. But today, he's doing something different. Meaning if he was to be in power, he will spoil everything. So ladies and gentlemen, what I'm trying to say is, it's not a everybody bandwagon, Peter, or bit, I, I'm personally coming out for him because I see him like somebody that has a vision. I mean, so I want to make this country better. Not be saying anytime we want better our life, we go travel. Peter Abbey has given us the reason why we think we should make him the president. Oh, I'm not an Igbo person. No, I'm not going to say because I'm not Igbo. I'm not an Igbo boy. You say, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a Nigerian. I don't like this when you want to say, where are you from? I'm a Nigerian. And anything that has to do with Nigeria that will make Nigeria a better place, I support that cause. And that's why I'm doing this. I'm not doing it for any financial, this thing. Say many people give money, no. I'm doing it because I decide to do it. I'm doing it for my future. I'm doing it for my children. I'm doing it for Nigeria as a whole. So thank you very much, guys. Thank you for the support. I've been given, I see my video more than share. I know they only do this, even I see other of my videos, share it. I'm a comedian, but see what thing Nigeria don't convert me to. I just have to do it because guy this country now we get out now our own and we need to make this country a better place in your own different areas if you feel you can do this i'll, I'll drop my number at the video maybe you reach out to me i'll add some persons on the on a particular whatsapp group and i'll try to sensitize others let's do the same thing everywhere it's not something that can carry alone we need help from other people other areas we need to reach out to people we need to reach out to these rural, rural areas we need to make them know the reason why they should stop looking at these men that are not ready to help us we need to change this narrative and it's not just the change we'll be hearing it's a positive change thank you very much my name is koboko thank you for your love and support nigeria must be good again i love you guys peace out yo so i want to pull up uh -huh. sorry I did not. So let me show you. Come on, I'm not going to say na na game. Na the speaker are buying. Uh -huh. So this is it. Uh -huh. So I'm opening the upper trunk. Let me know. Why are you doing this? So, uh -huh. so this is it. That's the stuff. As you can see, so I've unveiled it. 
Man, we unveil him in the two um, this thing in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, and also unveiling it. Allah, Inshallah, Allah, Allah. Okay, he will be like that. I'm going to blaspheme. Uh -huh. So, because all of us are one Nigeria will be. So that's it. This is the movement, and we're taking it to everywhere. So thank you very much, guys. And also so the man behind the camera. Yes, but again, I appreciate it. Get your PVC. Thank you, guys. So that's all the matter. Be. No, thank me, well. Thank you, well. Thank you, the man behind the camera.